Today we will talk about the intrinsically safe circuit. So you must have heard on board gas tankers, oil tankers and other dangerous cargoes, you have an intrinsically safe circuit. So there is a light fitted on board and these are the, these are the lights. So these are the intrinsically safe circuit and intrinsically safe light. So these are the gas proof explosion proof and waterproof lights so if you open and see uh, you can see like uh, you have the allen keys So you have now this Allen key keys. Can you see this is the Allen key? By this, you can open. So whenever you are working onto it, ensure that your power is cut off. Then there is no power available to the circuit. So, like if it is in pump room, so you will find. This will be, this is Allen key, but another one will be like D type, delta type and rectangular type. So no other key can fit into the, no other can key, key can fit into the sockets. So see, this now I am opening this. Open this, you can open this.
So you are opening it like this. See, you see, now the front cover is removed and then you have the light here. This light, you can open the four screws and this will come out and then you can change the light. Okay, so these are all the keys, like this is the Allen key, but on board and you will see the keys are of different kind. It could be of D type, it could be of some C type, it could be a rectangle type and different kind. So whenever you want to open this, so it can only open with their particular key. So like uh, for example, if you want to go to the pump room light, you want to go and check the pump room light and you have to go and see that your which light is bad. Suppose for example, it is LED. Uh, it is D type uh, lights are bad. So you will come to the CCR, there is the switches. So you will switch off the D type light and take out the key. And that key, only by that key you can open this cover. So your light is off, you have marked which light is to be changed. You will open that light from that particular uh, key and then change the lamp. After changing the lamp, again ensure nothing is left inside and then you will close the light. In some of the cases, you have like this. In some of the lights you have the chain, chain is connected with this, so your this portion is not falling down and this is already secured. This is secured with the guard, it is quite toughened glass and you have a chain and that chain is connected with the uh, cover, so it won't fall. So, so you have a safety of not falling, not breaking your lights and your safety because you have switched off the circuit. Now what happened? After closing this, we have replaced the bulb, after closing this everything, ensure the things are clear and all nut bolts are tightened enough because this is intrinsically safe and you have a safety, the, maybe gas carrier, maybe oil tanker. Okay, maybe chemical tanker. So where it is? And after finishing this, you will go to the CCR, take that key, switch on the circuit. And that's all. So you should understand that this is the intrinsically safe circuit. Okay. And the warning written on this, do not open when energized. So you should never open that when it is energized. So you must always ensure switch off the circuit, ensure that your earth is connected. This is the one screw is given and this is the earth mark. So this is for your ship's hull earthing is connected with this and this is the hanging point of your lamp. Okay.
सो आई होप दिस वीडियो मस्ट हेल्प यू द हाउ टू ओपन योर इंट्रेंसिकली सेफ लाइट एंड सेफ्टी ऑन बॉड थैंक यू